Yes, viewers and subscribers, big up on yourself, big up on yourself, big up on yourself, big up all of my long time subscribers, all of my new subscribers, big up and welcome to the channel. Yeah, maybe now for a few days, just get busy. I try to catch up on things, you know, but you know it go already. Yes, but from the outside looking in, this is what I'm seeing still. I don't know if everybody see it the way or I see it still. Them say when them say one man downfall is another man rise when one door shut one next door open and all these kind of saying now from the outside looking in looking at what's happening in jamaica with the situation where we know what the situation is like with all kind of different 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 sitting i go on personally i feel this is how i feel i feel like there are some countries out there in the world who it's not really a problem to them with what going to Jamaica. To me, I feel like them feel good in a way with what's going on. Yeah, I think that them feel good in, a, in what's going on with Jamaica, with the whole situation from the crime to the this and to the that and the that. I think that there are some countries that feel good. The reason why I say that is because, let's face it, let's face it, Jamaica is... Would I say one of the most beautiful places in the world? Regardless of what nobody wants to say. Jamaica to me is like the middle of the earth. Jamaica is like heaven upon earth. If you mind us, what go on with the situation, with the crime and all kind of something, where else you could have nicer than Jamaica? Me not think you could have no West Coast. When you check that little island there, it's very, very fruitful. When I say fruitful, boy, I don't know if nowhere else on earth have the amount of fruit tree where Jamaica have. Every fruit tree where you maybe you can find other places in the world, Jamaica have them. If I want one, somebody have one or two. Yeah? When you talk about food, naturally, like food, when you go into the hills where yam grow this, all kind of something, bread fruit, this, that, 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 that. Yeah? When you talk about pretty beaches, and all them type of things. I'm not saying that there's other places in the world that, that don't have pretty beaches, but trust me, when you talk about pretty beach, you come like Jamaica, I wish about White Sand Beach, Mech. You understand? We have so much to offer to the world. But with Wagwan, with the crime and thing now, a lot of people from the outside, maybe they might laugh and I say, yeah, because you know why? I say it. I say it because. If Jamaica was a little island that was running in a way where it was rid of crime and all kind of something, guess what would happen? The rest of the world and the rest of countries where have tourist resorts and all kind of something, they would have a problem because you know why? All eyes would be focused on Jamaica. Everybody from all both over the world would have. Jamaica couldn't hold people. Jamaica could not hold people. But because of the violence and things that go on, that kind of detour people, people kind of get one way and nobody no want to go for the holiday because they hear say this and that and nobody no want to go back or live because they hear say this and that and that and that and that. You understand? So, I feel personally that there are countries out there who, in some way, them benefit from what go on in Jamaica. Them benefit. Yeah. And if, if, if Jamaica, as I said, was running proper and the proper management and everything is around good. Trust me, Jamaica would be one of the Jamaica would be like a little Dubai. Our place name. Yeah. That's all Jamaica would be like a little Dubai. Yeah. But because of the madness where it take place, that now go on, that can go on. So in other way in other words people instead of people going to Jamaica for holiday and all kind of something even though it's such a beautiful beautiful place people looking to go elsewhere for them own safety and for them protection they feel more protected they feel more safe going to other places even though you have crime and violence at other places but maybe not as prevalent and as much as in Jamaica still you understand so all eyes is on Jamaica with what go on, you know. You see how crime and violence can mash up a country. 
And you see how much it can make people suffer. Cause just imagine. You just imagine. If them things they never had happen. A Jamaica. The hotel them couldn't hold people down there. Because the beauty of the place, people want to go figure everything, figure, figure experience the beauty, figure experience the culture, figure experience the food, figure experience the music, figure experience the weed, figure experience the wo all kind of something people are going to figure experience. But then hear about some people never experience it and hear about it. And every year, more and more, you'd have all 10, 15 cruise ships go to Jamaica one time. Man. The amount of people, you, you, the airline, airline them would have, trust me, you'd have to pay more for fear if you go to Jamaica because you can't get no flight because every, every flight is full. The fear would have dearer, right? yes, because it's in demand and people are travel hard to go to Jamaica. But now, maybe sometimes you can get fear cheap because nobody doesn't want to go. Nobody doesn't want to travel, so sometimes just say full up the space on the plane, them, them are give you all kind of offer and all kind of something. In spite of what I go on with the, with the, with the sitting here yeah, now. But apart from that, if those things wasn't happening and the crime situation wasn't to the highest level that it is right now, believe me people, a lot of other Caribbean islands and a lot of countries people are going to go for holiday, they would have feel it. But no, they might benefit because... Majority of the people who don't want to go to Jamaica for holiday and now go again, even though that non stop people, people still go. Said we, because as you know, when it comes to the tourists, no matter how the crime are going in our country, the tourist them is well protected. So sometimes when they reach the highest peak, people will go for holiday and they come back and say, Oh, I thought they said Jamaica was bad. Jamaica is beautiful. Jamaica is nice. There's nothing wrong in Jamaica. It's nice. Yes, because the place where they sit in go on, oh no, no, go there. Them no go there. Them go into the tourist resort area them where the security system beef up. And then again the criminal then know personally say one of the worst things they could have ever do is to disrupt the tourist them. Because as you know, the tourist is the golden goose. So if you disrupt that, then even when well if a slap away go on and government come like in turn a blind eye and you know see what go on. Touch a tourist or two tourists and make something happen and then you will see you would have never know so Jamaica have so much police and so much soldier. Pick them out. And quick quick time, who do what them find them feel shine a bright light over the rest of the world. So you know oh these citizens were attacked by Jamaicans and um in space of twenty four hours they were caught by the police and they are now in custody and this one is looking for fifteen year and twenty five year people overseas I say what? That's good. Jamaica good because if them can't get to it, certain things for so long, Jamaica a nice place we go. But because these people don't go to certain places, that's why they don't see and know certain things. You understand what I said though? So I just made us say all the vibes and all the meds and say, you know, so you have some country in the world right now where you like them benefit from what's happening in Jamaica and them like what I go on in Jamaica because when it's bad for Jamaica, it's good for them. And if it becomes good for Jamaica, then it becomes bad for them. Because they don't have what they offer. Like what Jamaica have to offer. They might have some of the things to offer, but Jamaica have more things to offer. Yeah. And people, let me know what you think. Leave your comment in the comment section. This is just my thoughts as well. That's something I'm thinking. And, um... For those of you who have not yet subscribed, please feel free to do so in your own time. And um, as I said, job bless. Don't stress over pest. Remember, I know one love, enough love. Anything we have done, I could do, go to the best of our ability. My people, remember this now. We have to wise up, to rise up, you know. And last but not least, we have to educate, to elevate. Manners and respect. I'm out, my people. Blessings.